Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Adam, and if you love luxury fashion, then you're definitely gonna love my channel. So make sure you like, subscribe, and check out my Instagram below for all of the latest updates. And today, let's get right into it. In today's video, I'm really excited because we are going to Versace. So Versace, they do have a new vacation collection that just released, and Dua Lipa and Versace actually teamed up to create this collaboration. So without any further ado, let's go to the store and see what they have. First, we will be starting with the sunglasses, and as you can see, so many options. Now, this specific one, I've been wanting for quite a few years now, so I think I'm going to pull the trigger and actually just get it. So, it's so cute. It's perfect with the Greca print on the side, and honestly, you really can't go wrong with these. It's the perfect fit, and it's the perfect look. And now we're getting into the new season, and this is so cute. Now, this material is so soft. I'm not sure what this material is. I will have to go back and look, but it is so cool. I absolutely love that. And then we do have this simple blue one as well. And the more I see the blue one, the more I actually want it. Right next to it, we have the blue jacket. And the blue jacket is so cute. I do end up trying it on. And then we have some more blue items as well. And then we can see another polo shirt. However, this one is in blue. And then we even have more blue over here with the polka dots. And the polka dots are actually really, really cute. I do wish it was the same print on the front and back because I do like the front better. We have this polo, which totally looks like my friend Devin. Devin, that is so you. I am going to be trying some of this on later. We even have this cute Versace version of the famous grocery boy shirt. Hashtag my sad truth video. So we're definitely going to be trying a lot on. We have this one and we even have some pinks over here. Now, these pinks, I love the pinks. It's totally giving me Sasha Cole vibes. However, the pink polo shirt in the back, which I'm about to get to, is so cute. This is so Barbie and so great for every day. And then over here, we have more neutrals, more whites, and more browns. Here we have the brown version of the blue jacket that we did see. Now, they do have it in pink as well, and I'm dying for the pink one, but definitely a lot of good selections. So I didn't expect to like the blue this much, but this fits so perfect. I 100% felt like Ken. Now this was a size 46 and it honestly was like tailored to me. So perfect. Let's actually try this with my Chanel bag and the blonde hair and the pink bag and this jacket. How cute is this outfit? This is so, so good. Like I'm honestly a little bit speechless of how cute this totally looks. I really want this, but I do want to try it in pink, so hopefully they can order a pink one. Here we have some of last season's clothing, which is on sale, and they did have a really cute sweater that I did want to try. So in the fitting room, we will be trying on these three items. So cute. I'm so excited. My first item is this giant Versace sweater. Now, usually I'm a size 46 or 48. In sweaters, I like a 48 and sometimes even a 50. However, this one is a 56. So this would be like an extra, extra, extra large on me. And this one is so cute. I love the fact that the sleeves were so super long like it was. And it does have the Greca print and the Medusa. This is so comfortable and great for like every day, especially to like wear at the house and sleep in. So cute. I absolutely love it. And now we have the towel shirt. Now, I do wish that this one was in pink, but again, I actually really like the blue. I thought it was really cute. Now, originally this does feel like the towel fabric, but I have to say that on the inside, there is actually a material and it kind of feels like a silk material. So you don't actually feel it on your skin. So because of that, I do totally approve it. And it's actually not bad because the more you wear it, the more comfortable it does feel. Trying on the shorts, they did not have my size. So these are like three times way too big as you can see, but I am gonna you know, hold it up and make it work for this video. But to be honest, I didn't really like the shorts because they are really, really long. Now, naturally, they do run long, so I would definitely have to get them tailored shorter and definitely more skinnier as well because they are more of a bulky fit than the top. Checking out some of the handbags. Now, this one actually totally goes with the Versace shirt I was trying on, the blue, but they did have it in this super cute pink as well. Now, when it comes to the La Medusa bags, we all know I absolutely love them. I have four of them, and I will be getting more as well. 
Now the handle on it is really, really thick and very, very sturdy. I'm honestly very, very proud of the handle on it because it is very amazing quality. And now for summer, we have more of the Crystal collection of their handbags. And this one is so cute, so Barbie and so pink. The way they glisten and glamour is just so, so adorable. Now for my favorite part, this was when I first walked into the store. They finally have the pink La Medusa collection and this is so gorgeous. So taking a close-up of this bag, it is so glamorous. It's the perfect shade of pink for me, and the material of it is very much like my Fendace La Medusa. So I was very interested in getting it. However, they only make it in a size small, so that is such a bummer. If they do make this in a medium, I will get this bag so fast because I love it so much, and if I had the pink jacket to match it, what a look this would be. Now they did have it in a tote version as well, and the tote version, I actually really love this. I'm considering getting it since they didn't have a medium size La Medusa in this colorway, but it even comes with the cute Do It With A Dust Bag as you've seen with the butterflies, and it even has a matching pair of heels to go with the bag. This tote bag also comes in two different sizes, and I think I would personally like the bigger one just for travel reasons. I think it's so perfect and so cute. But again, I'm just not entirely sure if I do need a tote bag with a giant opening like that. So, you know, I am considering it, but this is so cute and I kind of really do want it. On the back of the wall, we have more tote bags as well in the blue denim print. And the denim shoes are actually really cute too. I really do love the Versace denim vibes. And then for the special edition tote bag, this one was made by Dua Lipa, part of her collaboration. So cute with the butterflies and the polka dots and even the ladybugs. So adorable. This bag has a lot of embroidery on it. Even on the back, there's so much detail and so much work to it. And this is just such a beautiful bag, especially for the summer. I was definitely surprised that I found a Greca Goddess bag in silver hardware in black. I never seen this bag before in silver. And I think this is so cool. I absolutely love it. More of their everyday handbags. We have some of the La Medusa collection. As you know, like I said, I love the La Medusa. Regardless if it comes in the totes, the handbags, or even like the mini bags, I honestly love them all. Here we have the La Medusa repeat hobo bag collection. And we do have the La Medusa in silver hardware as well, which is on the list. I'm just debating when is the right moment to get it. And are they going to make one without the zippers? Because if they make a silver one without the zippers, I would be a little bit more interested in that one. And that's because the zippers, they don't open. They do open, but you can't put anything in them. It's just a leather lining in it. So the zippers are honestly a missed opportunity. And now we are at Saks Fifth Avenue looking at the same collection, but now we're able to see some other options that they didn't have in the Versace boutique. Like these swim shorts are really cute. I do want to try them on, but I was in a little bit of a rush. So I'll be coming back to try those on. And then we even have some of the pink towel collection. So the pink long shirt is so cute absolutely love it. There is a hat that I really want that would match it. So I did make an appointment with Versace already. They are ordering in the hat so I could come try it on with some of the pink clothing. So I'm super thrilled about that. And then behind the pink sweater, again, we have more of the pink silk items. Really, really cute. But again, I wish the back was a little bit more simple and matched the front of it. We have some simple Versace polo shirts, always super cute. We now have Alexander McQueen and this button up is really, really cool. I honestly did want to try that on as well, but something I'm really happy about is I finally tried on the Louboutins that I've been looking at for like three years. Now these retail for $3,200, but my sizing was just not right in these ones for some reason. I tried on a 41, I even tried on a 40, and neither of them were fitting accurately. So unfortunately, I didn't get these ones, but I'm really disappointed because I've been wanting these shoes for such a long time. And unfortunately, they're just not right for me. And then I'm really proud to say in my next vlog coming very soon, we go to Hermes. And I do have some very special news with Hermes. Somebody is officially on a wait list for a Birkin. So stay tuned for my next vlog where we go to Hermes and see that some dreams are coming true. So for this collection, they had so many cute stuff, but not a lot in store. As you've seen, they really only had like the blue collection, but not all of it. And they only had very little pink towel items, but in the Saks Fifth Avenue. Now, one item that I 100% will be getting, well, I do have to try it on, is the pink bucket hat. Now, this pink bucket hat is so cute. I think it'll be so great with this pink Versace shirt and even my pink Lama Medusa shoulder bag. 
both have videos. They will be linked in the description below. I do already have a bucket hat from Versace, Prada, and a baseball cap from Versace as well. The video will be linked right above here and in the description below. But for the hat, I think the fabric towel material would be so perfect. Again, it would be so cute with this outfit. But I did text my brand new essay because unfortunately Nicholas did leave Versace. He was my favorite essay. He really went above and beyond. I mean, I remember one time I even cried in the dressing room because the smallest size was too small for me. And if we tailored it in, I would lose like half of the print on the actual shirt. So Nick has really been through it with me and he has been so great. So, you know, like rest in peace when it comes to like Nicholas at Versace. He's still alive. He just went to Tiffany's and I do have a Tiffany's vlog coming up as well. That will be one of my next vlogs. Hermes and Tiffany, so stay tuned for that. But when it comes to this vacation collection, there are a couple items that I still want to try. So right now I'm going to have a little scrolly thing right up here of all of the collection. And right away for the men's section, you can see that this blue hoodie is so cute. Honestly, the blue hoodie, I really do want to try it. I didn't think I would like the blue color as much as the pink, but I actually like them the same after trying on the blue, so it is so cute. Of course, you know, they have another version of the hat, but this time with strings on it, so it does stay tuned. A lot of butterfly prints, but again, the pink towel fabric, I love everything in this collection pretty much, and it is just so cute. Another really cute item was the polka dots as well. For some reason, the blue polka dots with like that light green color is so cool to me. I really like it. Now, I did try that on as well. It just wasn't on camera. It didn't look the best on me with my skin tone. I was very washed out, but still, it's so cute to look at. Now, the denim jacket was so cool. Obviously, I loved trying that on. Of course, I really, really do want it in pink, so hopefully I can eventually try a pink one on because I actually might get it. It is a little pricey. It's $2,400, but you always have to think at the end of the summer, there will be a sale, so it will be like $1,000, which is probably like $1,200 in like two months, so that is definitely something to keep in mind. Now for the women's section, so many cute items. Honestly, hands down, this black with the white polka dots and the butterflies, this is such a cute outfit. I'm honestly living for the prints. It does have the matching bag as well and the heels. So, so cool. You will also be seeing a lot of jewelry that Dua Lipa wore in her Barbie video, the Come Dance With Me video. Once again, I will have that linked in the description too. Honestly, one of my favorite songs at the moment. It's so fun and so Barbie. But a lot of clothes that she's wearing is, of course, Versace. So the entire collection, she's wearing it in the video. And of course, it is available online. So this women's section, honestly, is so cool, especially the giant choker that she wears. Absolutely amazing. A few items that I really want to pay attention to are these butterfly heels. Now, these ones are so cute and so cool. They even come in pink and the pink ones hands down absolutely amazing so girly i kind of want to try them on not gonna lie because i did get my very first pair of heels it's a barbie pair that video will be coming up as well but these heels they're so cute and one thing i was really happy about is the colors of the bag so there's a lot of handbags that are now pink and like this one right here so cute absolutely love it but the thing is, I don't really like the texture of it because it's like the Balenciaga crush bag. And the only reason I haven't bought the crush bag yet is because I'm not a fan of the leather on it. It feels like it's gonna like break apart and rip over time, but that's just the look of it. So I'm not really too fond of it. It really has like Chanel 19 vibes when it comes to like the quality, but I do really, really like the look of it. It is really cute but it's just the material. I wish it was just like a smooth leather material, but so cute. And last but not least, this outfit right here, I cannot tell you how bad I wish I could wear this. This is just the cutest thing. I'm trying to see how I could actually make this work. Maybe I could put like a white button up underneath or even a pink button up that matches it. So cool. It's like a harness type vibe. And it is, this is just such a beautiful piece of clothing. It is just so sexy and seductive and so Barbie. And this right here, it's like Prada meets Versace. And it's just like so, so great. Hands down, like best piece in the collection that I have to say. And honestly, it's just like, wow, so cute.
So as I wrap up the video, I will have more of the collection on screen because there's honestly just so much stuff for you guys to see. But this collection, it is really, really good. I really do want the hat. That's the number one thing I want. And then I definitely do want something of the towel material to wear. Definitely in the color pink. But I, like I said, I really like the blue, especially because this fall I will be dyeing my hair back to black. So after Barbie summer, I will no longer be the blonde pink Barbie that I am, but I will go back to my normal black hair. But oh my god, so cute. I really, really do love this collection. And it's just so Barbie. And it's going to be such a Barbie summer. I love it so much. Okay, and that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Stay tuned for my next vlog where I will be going to Hermes and Chanel. And I have a very big announcement to make at Hermes. Somebody is officially on a waitlist for a Birkin. So I'm so excited about that. I mean, Birkin goals, yes. But really cool shopping vlogs coming up. So stay tuned for that and have a great day. Au revoir.